Yo, what's up guys? Stealthwick here from Team Vesper. Um, we've been uploading quite a bit lately, and um, we want to keep this momentum going, so without further ado, here is another glitch video. We're looking at a few maps, obviously on Vertigo right here, but um, all these we found ourselves, and um, yeah, they're all copyright to us. Basically, I'm just going to show you around this map first, and then I'm going to hop on my Titan and show you the major glitches. One right here. You just actually two jump up to this one. I can walk along this whole thing right here. And uh, great view of B. Also, right around this area. You can walk along this peg. And there's the same one over here. So if you have a buddy, absolutely pretty cool. But you can always get reported for this stuff if enough people report you. So you always got to be aware of that if you're going to do it in a real match. And um, I've possibly found a way to get outside the map. I'm just going to show you guys a few more spots. And then I'm going to hop to my Titan and actually show you them uh, in detail and stuff. So the first one, you can get here in a lot of ways. But you're going to get here. You actually don't need a sword. For this one, you might need a sword. It's kind of recommended. Just get right here. And then simply just jump straight up here. Um, pretty cool. Pretty good view. But we're going to amp it up quite a bit. And we're going to jump a little bit high and get on top of this pipe. There's a turn back if you go high enough, so you just want to be aware of that. But look at this view, guys. It's just, it's kind of amazing. Um, heavy right there, obviously pretty crazy. And um, yeah, I haven't figured out how to get outside the map from here. Hopefully you guys could figure it out or something. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, you can actually get under this thing right here, but um, you'll be floating there and you can't really move and then you're gonna have to end up killing yourself. But anyways, back to the point. You're gonna get here, get right here. Get this edge and sword climb your way up, just like I did. It's a very small edge that you can stand on. And once again, we're going to amp it up. Found a little invisible edge that you can get on. Um, pretty insane. You can walk across both ways. And um, <laughs> honestly, this is kind of, it's insane pretty much. Rift, a lot of people go through this. Obviously, you never. I've never done this in a crystal match. This is terrible. This is not the way to play Destiny. But with the game being so dry at the moment, um, what else is there to do? So um, that's that. Now I'm gonna hop on my Titan and show you some other cool ones. And we're ready to go to the part two of this glitch. Okay. So if you don't know how to like Titan skate or actually like float in the air forever, obviously it's got to be a mayhem. So be aware of that. But basically, what you're gonna do is just jump. As high as you can until you run out and then twilight and then do just keep repeating or else your jumps will go on and off I'm, i mean i'm pretty sure everyone knows how to do this but if you don't bam right there um if you don't want to do the whole advanced glitch you can just there's a little spot right here that you can get on it's not as good as the whole glitch but if you're not that advanced at doing anything you can always get here uh, not that great, but yeah, I'm basically gonna look for this edge right there. See the reason um, We're not gonna just go under it. This is under the map glitch by the way The reason we're not just gonna go straight through there is because there's a death wall and barrier along that edge So we're gonna actually have to go around so need a sword for this, but it's just easier to see in third person in my opinion sit up Just like that get under the map make this turn really quick the barrier is literally right below you, so you can't fall. Just gotta keep everything. You're gonna back up, like I'm doing now, and you see that peg? That's exactly what we're getting on. Bam, just like that. Takes a lot of practice, but basically where we're at right now is right there is A. That's stairwell to A. Sadly, we can't cannot go up anywhere, but um, it's kind of just crazy to be here and stuff. Just under the map completely. I'm just gonna show you the barrier right now, guys. This is literally, you cannot go low at all. Bam, death barrier. So you gotta hug the ground, and that's why it's best to do it on the Titans. Last um, out of the map glitch on this, uh, we are going to get farther than down there and we're actually going to plummet all the way down to that edge down there. Ooh. I freaking suck at life. 
basically Bungie has completely forgotten about barriers and barrier uh, rules of barriers <laughs> and basically they put a hole in their barriers so I'm gonna show you guys right now we will hit a barrier sooner or later there it is cannot go any farther I'm just going against nothing but if we scoot over just a little bit BAM <laughs> our freaking little hole through the map and we're just pretty much free to roam wherever we go if you go too far out you will um, die but we're just gonna back up just about to this length because the death barrier is still there but we just gotta get out far enough to where it's gone and everybody's just gonna drop from here sure you have that twilight ready to go and now we're under the barrier so there's the map and we're just gonna surf over here you can do it in this area and where the portal is those are the only two areas you can do this in but we're just gonna fly under here you can just go on whatever ridge you want just make sure you're below the death barrier my favorite one is right here it's really nothing you can do here guys but once again still a very cool spot to be in see the ships see the lightning it's kind of cool to watch and stuff um, all that stuff down there is clear you can go down there if you want you will hit a death barrier sooner or later all those ships are clear um, if we look up this is a really cool view of it you can see that's the way we cross through that's the island and uh, overall really cool you do that same whole thing where you go through a hole and then wrap around you can go to the back of the portal there's nothing you really stand on but you can just look on the back of the portal I guess it's kind of cool that all this stuff down here is clear um, you can use bubble or strike your Titan just blast your way down and then twilight at the right time to get back to this ledge as you can see it's all clear it's very weird actually nothing is really solid and then sooner or later death barrier but yeah just explore around with this this is the other area that you can go to just jump out here bam jump out bam jump out just get far enough to where there's for sure no barriers at all and explore it's pretty cool um if you were to land a snipe here that'd be pretty pretty cool but um I haven't myself. Honestly, this isn't really cheating at all. Um, Bungie let us do this, and um, we're not uh, we're not under the map. We're not really out of the map. We're just flying around uh, on our Titan. So, uh, Mayhem Clash is the. Um, well, by the time I'm uploading this, you only have one more day. But Mayhem Clash is the actual um, playlist for the type. But obviously, tomorrow's Age of Triumph, and everyone's gonna be on that shit. Now we're either gonna move on to Asylum. Or crossroads. Um, we're gonna be getting over here. Um, this I'm pretty sure it's not too hard for any character. Um, for sure, warlocks could probably actually do this one. Basically, you could either do the really quick way and just get straight to it, or um, if you want to kind of test yourself, if you can't make it up to here right away, you can actually get on this lower part. And um, just try not to blind yourself with the light. That's usually what happens to me. I always get blinded by that and then don't know where I'm going. But then you can just rise up to here. And um, pretty good spot. I wish you could get in here. That'd be pretty cool. Back to the portal. Obviously a big barrier. Kind of sad, but yeah. Um, that's that. And um, if you guys didn't know, this one we didn't find. But obviously that one, I'm pretty sure everyone knows that one where you slide under the portal. You can almost do this with every single one of these boosters. Um, it's honestly really strange. I don't think anyone's figured this out. Basically, um, we're not going to need sword ammo, but you're just going to want to back up into this very slowly. Sword swipe, twilight, just do whatever you can to stay in this. Alright, just for sake of time, um, I'm just going to have a sword just so I can get to this faster. Basically, once you go into it, just do this. Swipe, and as you can see, we're just like in the tube of the launching. You can actually get out of this with uh, death from above and stuff, but it's kind of cool you can you can do this and you can go for pretty far lengths but the coolest part about this is getting to the sweet spot as you can see our titan is kind of jiggling around like right there and stuff and that's because this tube has edges this barrier has edges that you can clip on so if we get close enough i might be able to get it if i can get this this would be great it's right oh i was just in it oh my god there it is bam we're floating and um 
pretty cool. Um, I, I've never seen anybody do this or figure out that this launcher actually has a tube. But yeah, pretty intense. And um, I've never seen anybody do it. We have done it on that one. We have not been able to do it on that one. For that one, I'm pretty sure you're going to need shoulder charge. And we got stuck right in the middle. I don't know how we did it. But explore with these guys. Obviously, there's going to be more edges than this one. Like, as you can see, I just hit a bunch right there. So you can, if you guys can find an edge, comment down below. Um, try to explain where it is and stuff. And, um, yeah, we can figure out the rest of these glitches and stuff. So without further ado, we're going to go to the last map, which is Asylum. And we got a pretty crazy one for you guys. All right, so here we are on Asylum. And the best thing about this one, it's not an insane out-of-the-map glitch. It's not a... Um, just, it, it, it's a cheese spot, all right, and it's pretty amazing. This is founded by Bandit. He's on the team. Um, it has to do with this special crate. This is what you would call a bendable barrier. It um, can be forced through with a lot of force, but yeah, it can be. You can get back there. So that's exactly what we're gonna do with this special crate right here. We're just gonna basically try to angle yourself as best you can on your character um, to what I'm doing right now. So you can see our legs kind of line with that back edge right there. And uh, my foot's just kind of diving in. I'm at a really small angle, but I am at an angle. Notice that. I'm trying to match this up to the footage that we actually got of doing it. So, yeah. We're going to wait for this to come in. And hopefully we can get this first try. And I can show you guys what you can do in there. Bam. So that time I had to stand up. Uh, usually it'll just push you back. I have footage of it. I'll show that now. Mm -hmm. They were gods. Dude, yes, let's go. Okay, so now since you just did it, I know how to do it every time now. Yeah. But yeah. yeah. So, um, you can get shot through this and you can shoot people through it. Um, you can throw bomb. Ooh. Okay, you can throw bombs, but it's kind of hard. <laughs> Basically, to not get shot or to be prevented from being shot, you just want to go back here, weave back here, trying to get over here, slide back here, and get back here. Basically full cover and no one's gonna notice you. If you have a green shader, it'd be pretty good. Um, basically, there's nothing you can do really here. You can kind of get in this tree. Kind of cool. Try to show you guys exactly how much cover you have there. Um, just a lot. It's kind of crowded, but honestly, like this is probably one of like the biggest glitches or cheese spots that we've ever found. Um, I have tried this on dungeons with the heavy crate. You guys should keep trying it because. Honestly, I feel like we could do this um, with basically any crate now that we know they're actually forcible. So, um, you can actually pick up the special if you get the right angle. And, um, yeah, you can shoot through it. There's an A right there. Um, pretty cool. And I'm going to show you, to finish up the video, a few more spots that I found on this uh, map myself. Alright, so right here, we're not the founder of this. Uh, if you don't know this spot, um... Uh, I got a question for you. Have you been living under a rock? Everyone uses this in trials, and, um, yeah, if you don't know the follow-up for it, I mean, not follow-up, but you can get on this edge, you can get on this edge, you can get in the tree, um, you can get on the screen up here. Oh, these trees are kind of getting in my way, guys. You can get on the screen. That's like, you're pushing the barrier on the screen, though. Um, what I found on this map is kind of cool. You guys might find, not find it cool, but uh, I found it cool. If you look right here, through this little crack, you can see if you change your angles, the inside of that back room adjusts, and so did the map with it. Um, so you get a better view, you can get on the right, up to these pipes over here. And that's also pushing the barrier. The barrier's right there. But, um, pretty OP. It's just like the window spot, but in my opinion, better. Got a lot more, co uh, like, not cover, but a lot of people don't expect you up here, and it is a little bit higher than the window as well. Um, if you don't know, I'm not the founder of this either. These, uh, you know, needles or whatever you can get on this one and that lower one. Um, I just figured this out a few days ago. Pretty sure it's already been found. Billboard. You got a really good view of mid lane. And uh, down here, there are a few good ones. If you didn't know this one. And um, I haven't tried this one in a while. Pretty sure it's patched. Yeah, it's patched. Um, but yeah, and then back here, 
you can get on these pipes right here and then get also on this and then also if you're back on these pipes crouch under all these and just a pretty cool spot I'm pretty sure that was already found that was the old glitch to get out of the map you get there you there and then you would sword swipe over that ledge and you basically get behind everything but now sadly can't do that I remember you get back there and it was just like it was the coolest spot I love that spot but sadly it is gone and um I mean sorry if you didn't do it it was it was pretty cool but um, that's going to sum it up for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed, and if you did, please leave a like. If you haven't subbed, please do. And, um, yeah, we're basically, I still got tons more. I just wanted to make this video kind of short. I don't want to extend it too long. And so we got tons more maps to show you guys, and um, just a bunch more glitches. So stay tuned for that. Also, Dual Touch is coming out soon. Um, it's going to be pretty lit, and uh, we're going to do our best. Uh, getting clips and edits and stuff. We already got a bunch of clips, and that's probably going to be one of the best vid uh, videos and montages on our channel. So um, keep out for that. Watch well, should be out within the next month. And uh, yeah, without nothing to say, Team Vespero.